hello friends welcome back to another video in this video i am going to show you how to install Mautic on amazon aws hosting account i hope you have successfully created aws account so we need to log in so for that we need to go to aws.amazon.com and here we need to click on sign in to the console Here we need to put the username and password so I am pausing the video. So I am logged in into my account. Here we need to click on services and we need to click on EC2. If the account is new all this will be zero like this ok. Now we need to click on ME's. MS is basically called Amazon Machine Image. It provides the information required to launch an instance. You must specify an ME when you launch an instance. In our case, it will be Mautic. Okay, so we need to click MES, and once you click on MES, you will end up on this page. And here we need to click on find more than 500 MES of popular open source and commercial software from AWS marketplace okay so we need to click on this once you click on this it will land up on Amazon AWS marketplace and here we need to search for Mautic so there are a couple of other options to choose but I'll go with Mautic certified by Bitnami because it is free so let's click on this And here we need to click on continue to subscribe. And then we need to click on continue to configuration. Here we need to keep this as it is and for software version also we need to keep this as it is. But in region, if you want to select any other region, you can select by clicking on the drop down. But I will go with US East, not Virginia. The reason to select this region is because we will also be using Amazon SES. So Amazon SES is only supported in few regions. So if you want to check, uh, Amazon SES is supported only in this regions. Okay. You can see US East, not Virginia. So I want to keep both EC2 and Amazon SES in the same regions. So that's the reason I am selecting US East, not Virginia. And it is better to keep both the things in same region and you should also do the same. Okay, so now let's click on continue to launch. Here we need to select few things choose action uh, we need to click on launch through EC2 okay so once you click on launch through EC2 it will give you this option so let's click on launch so here we need to keep this option as it is and then we need to click on review and launch and then we need to click on launch so here we need to select the key pair but uh, I don't have any key pair so we will create one so here it is here there are two options create a new key pair or proceed without key but we will create a new key pair key pair is nothing but it's like a password to access the server so here we need to click on create new key pair and we need to give a name for this key pair so i'll give mautic hyphen login you can give any name you want okay so let's download this key pair okay so 
my keypad has been downloaded and it is saved in my uh, PC so I'll close this and I'll click on launch instance So here it is giving a message that your instance are now launching. So we need to come down and we need to click on view instance. So here it is we can edit this name by clicking on this pencil icon. So I'll give a name of Motic and I'll click on this so now Motic is successfully hosted on EC2 instance to view this we need to uh, click on this IP address and we need to go to a browser and we need to paste it here it is taking time because if you can see a status check initializing so it will take some time so once it is done then you can view the so you can view the login page for Motic. so we need to wait for a while we need to just refresh okay so once i go again so you here you can see that uh, we have successfully uh, installed Motic on ec2 instance and it is asking for username and password so that I'll show you in the next video in the upcoming lectures also uh, in the future videos we will connect this IP address to our domain name so you can access it through your domain instead of uh, accessing it through the IP address okay to log in this we need the credentials that I'll show you in the next video so this, that's it for this video and I'll see you in the next video take care and bye bye